Silkworms in Japanese labs are spinning a new kind of fabric. They've been genetically engineered to produce silk that glows. And researchers hope the worms will help revitalize the industry that played a big role in the modernization of Japan. The splendid colors of a magnificent kimono. What makes this piece so special is that the threads of silk are luminescent. They're the result of a research project that could revolutionize Japan's silk industry. The project is led by the National Institute of Agrobiological Studies. Researchers manipulated the genes of silkworms by introducing genes from other life forms into their eggs. They succeeded in producing a silkworm with new characteristics. We inserted the genes that provide the phosphorescence in jellyfish and coral. That's why the yarn glows. Here's one of the silkworms born from this manipulation. When light of a specific wavelength is projected onto it, the worm's body emits an orange color. The glow comes from the silk thread inside the worm's body. It's luminescent, like some types of jellyfish and coral. Fabric made from this thread could produce all kinds of products with high added value, ranging from glowing garments to original lampshades. In the 1930s, there were more than two million silk farms across the country, but the growing availability of artificial fibers and increased international competition led to the decline of Japanese silk. Only 500 silk farms remain active in Japan. Their owners are pinning high hopes on the potential of this technology. It's very attractive for us, but it also means higher costs. And it's not like we would be free to grow these silkworms anywhere. The process involves gene manipulation, so it requires the authorization of the agriculture ministry. Production would be limited to specific farms. One necessary precaution is to make absolutely sure that genetically modified organisms don't breed with natural species. Researchers at the Institute are working hard to turn this futuristic project into reality. Once the process is determined to be safe, they hope to make their modified variety of silkworms available to farms and put their idea into practical use within a few years. The potential of genetic manipulation is not limited to silk that glows. One example is this garment that incorporates the characteristics of spider thread. Introducing the genes of spider thread makes the fabric 20% stronger and 30% more stretchy. There's a whole range of possibilities. For example, inserting the genes of the kind of thread that produced underwater by aquatic insects could make a garment more water resistant. Our aim is to produce a type of material it can only be made with Japanese technology, and we hope a revival of the silk industry. The question now is whether these 21st century worms will be enough to give hope to Japan's ailing silk industry. To make the silk filaments come off easily, she first dunks the cocoons in hot water for five minutes. To make the silk filaments come off easily, she first dunks the cocoons in hot water for five minutes.